What do you think about my offer? You take out Cyborg Betty White and I'll permanently dismantle G.I. Joe. Uh, I don't know, Donnie. I think I'm gonna pass. It's not that I don't want to help you. As a leader of a terrorist organization, I'm a big fan of your work. I just don't think that Cobra has the resources to take on Cyborg Betty White. No? Well, that's a shame. What about you, Destro? Any interest in creating a weapon for us that can defeat Cyborg Betty White? <laughs> Absolutely not. Only a fool would think they could defeat Betty White. <laughs> and also, Duh. there's more to the story than that. Ah, oh, come on. Go on. Well, might as well. Betty and I dated for a while back in the 80s. Oh, no way. Yeah. Well, you know, uh, the Baroness and I were fighting a lot over the Weather Dominator project. And uh, we took a break. And me and Betty kind of, uh, you know. Oh, Destro. Anyways, not a big deal. But I could never betray my Betty. Then get out of my office, you useless liberals. Or did you ever think of reaching for the stars? Space Force, gonna make my dream come true. It's the place for me and you. Space Force, saving America from space. Awesome Squadron. The country is still waiting for a response from the president as it has been a week since the news broke about Russia paying Uranians bounties for killing American soldiers. But in today's news, the president has gotten a few bills passed outlawing any person or show who is found to be spreading fake news. The law goes into effect immediately and some hosts like John Oliver and Trevor Noah have already been shut down by authorities to be spreading fake news. Have you seen what's been going on back on Earth? Something ain't right. Restricting the press is not something that should be happening in a free country. Like, how is that even legal? There's a lot that doesn't make sense. Take President Donnie's war with Uranus. They never attacked us or cared about us. So why are we fight? We are fighting so the powers can go in and strip Uranus of its vast resources. I'm tired of losing friends or seeing them get hurt so politicians could get richer. My tour can't be up fast enough. I need to get away from this. I hear you, sister. Well, it is finally here. For those of you that have missed it, Alpha Clone Donnie has taken over the roles of both the ship captain and the first mate. So tonight, we have four clones who will be debating each other as to why they should be the second mate and Alpha Clone will make his decision. Yes, it is a very bigly day here, very bigly day. This debate should be one for the history thingies. Yes, and of course, as always, the debate will be moderated by an old, white, out-of-touch racist news anchor. As it should be, yes. And it looks like we are starting. Okay, here we go. Every clone will have 20 seconds to answer the questions presented to them. You will only answer questions when it's your turn. Are you ready? Clones. Do you support white supremacy? Clone 349, I'll start with you. Yes, of course, who doesn't? Is that really a question? But for right now, I am standing down and standing by. I'm the most supportive of white supremacy groups. I'm the bigliest supporter of white supremacy. The bigliest and the best. Wow, those were some really great answers. Yes, it's hard to tell who I like more at this point. I can already tell this is going to be a close one. All right, for the next question. As the second mate, what is the one thing you will approve upon? Well, I mean, where are all the chicks, man? I'm not over here trying to grab sausage. And what's Ivanka doing? Oh, that's a really good point. Yes, I like him. He stands out like a real leader. Clone 542, same question. Guys, we have a real problem brewing. You have a problem brewing? Men, please let each other have their time. Yes, so we have a real problem. Problem with you keep talking. Let the gentleman talk. Okay, we have a problem. Our space burger supply is dwindling at an alarming rate, and we need to act now. I'll build a wall around the space burgers. Problem solved. Moving on. Damn it, we need a real solution. That's why I suggest we take control of the space burger plant near Miami. I love space burgers. Hey, me too. You want to sneak away and get some really quick? They don't keep them guarded. Do I? I'm so glad I've surrounded myself with the best idea, men. Let's go to the chow hall. You should pick me. I just aced my cognitive test. 
I totally know what an elephant is. Well, I'm a master debater. No, pick me. I'm the best. Me, 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 me. Pick me. Wow, this is a really good debate. Me, 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 me. This is a close one. This might be the most heated debate in the history of debates. Me, me, me. Will you, you shut, shut up, man? man? How Winche Mechuan Rebang Wushi Yifu. It is done. People, time is running out, and we may have to extend the clock. But first, like this video and subscribe to this channel. Then leave a comment because I need help. I can't answer these left-wing curveball questions like, are you willing to condemn white supremacist groups? How does a person even answer that? I mean, I can tell you what an elephant is or a person, woman, man, camera, TV, but that question is hard.